Ever wondered what your feline friend is trying to tell you? They might be more than just moody. Today, we delve into a topic that holds immense importance for all cat parents out there, understanding when your cat might be unwell. Cats, being the mysterious and independent creatures that they are, communicate their discomfort in ways that are often subtle and easy to miss. It's not always a loud meow or a noticeable limp. Sometimes it's a change in their eating habits or a sudden shift in their behavior. It's a language that's unique to them, a secret code we need to crack. And that's exactly what we're here to do today. By understanding these signs, we can ensure our furry friends get the care they need when they need it and continue to live their nine lives to the fullest. Stay tuned as we uncover the top five signs your cat might be unwell. Moving on to sign number four, watch out for any changes in your cat's behavior. Cats are creatures of habit, and any significant variations in their regular conduct could signal that something is amiss. Let's talk about this in more detail. One of the most noticeable changes could be increased aggression. Your once docile and loving fur baby might suddenly start hissing, biting, or scratching. This could be a response to pain or discomfort. Just like humans, cats too can get cranky when they're not feeling their best. On the other end of the spectrum, lethargy is another behavior change to keep an eye on. If your lively, playful feline friend suddenly starts spending most of the day sleeping or simply lying around with no interest in their favorite toys, it's a cause for concern. Lethargy may be a sign of various health issues, ranging from minor infections to serious conditions like heart disease. Another behavior change that might seem strange is sudden clinginess. If your independent kitty starts following you around the house, demanding constant attention, or even just sitting close to you more than usual, it might not be just a sudden burst of affection. Cats are experts at hiding their pain, and they might seek comfort from their humans when they're feeling unwell. However, it's crucial to remember that these changes could also be due to stress or changes in the environment. Moving to a new house, introducing a new pet or family member, or even changing your work schedule can lead to changes in your cat's behavior. So it's essential to consider the whole context before jumping to conclusions. But when in doubt, it's always better to err on the side of caution. If you notice any drastic changes in your cat's behavior, it's best to consult with a vet. They can help determine whether these changes are due to stress, environment, or an underlying health issue. Remember, your cat's behavior can tell you a lot about their health. So stay observant and attentive to ensure your furry friend is always in the best possible shape. Sign number three takes us to the grooming habits of your cat. Cats, as many of us know, are meticulous groomers. They're the epitome of cleanliness in the animal kingdom, dedicating a significant portion of their waking hours to cleaning and grooming themselves. It's an integral part of their routine, a testament to their independence, and a reflection of their health. So when this routine changes, it might be more than just a quirky new habit. It could be a sign of trouble. A change in your cat's grooming habits can come in various forms. Perhaps you've noticed that your cat's once glossy and smooth fur has become dull, matted, or greasy. This could indicate that your cat isn't grooming as much as they used to. It might be because they're feeling unwell or it could be a sign of dental problems as grooming can be painful for a cat with a sore mouth. On the other hand, over-grooming can also be a sign that something's amiss. If your cat is constantly licking or chewing at their fur, leaving bald patches or sores, it might be a sign of stress, allergies, or skin conditions. In these situations, your cat is trying to soothe themselves, and their grooming habits become a form of self-medication. Changes in grooming habits might also point to psychological issues. Cats are creatures of habit, and any disruption in their routine can lead to anxiety or stress. If your cat's grooming habits have changed drastically, it might be a sign that they're feeling anxious or stressed. The key takeaway from sign number three is this, changes in your cat's grooming habits aren't something to be ignored. They're often a sign of an underlying issue that needs attention. It's crucial to observe and understand these changes as they can provide valuable insights into your cat's health. Remember, you know your cat better than anyone else. You're their first line of defense when it comes to their well-being. Keep an eye on your cat's grooming habits as they can be a window into their health. A sign number two involves your cat's litter box usage. This might seem like a mundane detail, but it's a crucial aspect of your cat's health and well-being. Changes in litter box habits can indicate a variety of health problems. Let's begin with the frequency of usage. If your cat is visiting the litter box more frequently than usual, it could be a sign of a urinary tract infection or kidney disease. 
Both of these conditions can cause increased thirst, leading to more frequent urination. On the flip side, if your cat is using the litter box less often, it might be experiencing constipation or other digestive issues. Next, we have the consistency of your cat's waste. Hard or dry stools can be a sign of dehydration or a low-fiber diet. Conversely, loose or watery stools might indicate food intolerance, intestinal parasites, or gastrointestinal conditions. If you notice blood in your cat's stool or urine, it's important to seek veterinary care right away, as this can be a sign of serious health issues. Accidents outside the box can also be a telling sign. If your cat, who is usually well-behaved, starts to eliminate outside the litter box, it could be due to a number of reasons. It might be experiencing stress, it could have a urinary tract infection, or it might be reacting to a change in its environment, such as a new litter type. Addressing these changes involves understanding the potential reasons behind them. If the changes are sudden or drastic, it's best to consult a veterinarian immediately. They can perform tests to diagnose any underlying health conditions. If the changes are more subtle, you might consider adjusting your cat's diet or environment to see if it helps. Remember, you know your cat better than anyone else. If something seems off, it probably is. Your cat relies on you to notice these changes and take the necessary actions to ensure its health and happiness. Never overlook changes in litter box usage. It's an important sign of your cat's health. And finally, the most obvious sign, physical changes. When it comes to our feline friends, any visible physical changes can be a red flag. Perhaps your cat has suddenly lost weight or their once lustrous coat has become dull and lackluster. Maybe they're showing signs of visible discomfort such as limping or wincing when you touch a certain area. These are all indications that something might be amiss. Remember, cats are masters of disguise when it comes to hiding their pain. So it's up to us, their caregivers, to notice these subtle shifts. Regular vet checkups are crucial in catching these changes early. Your vet can provide a thorough examination and nip potential issues in the bud before they escalate. Physical changes in your cat are not to be taken lightly. They're clear signs that something is not right and it's time to seek professional help. Physical changes in your cat are clear signs that it's time to visit the vet. Recognizing these signs can make a significant difference in your cat's health and happiness. It's essential to keep in mind the top five signs that your feline friend might be unwell. Changes in eating habits, alterations in behavior, variances in grooming habits, and shifts in litter box usage, along with any physical changes, can all be significant indicators that something may not be right with your beloved pet. Regular vet checkups are crucial in maintaining your cat's health, but so is your vigilance. Paying close attention to any changes, no matter how minor they might seem, can be the difference between early detection and intervention, and a more severe health issue down the line. Our cats rely on us to understand their needs and ensure their well-being. Remember, you know your cat best. Trust your instincts and never hesitate to seek professional help when needed. Your cat's health is worth it.